What's going on guys, Phantom Flash here, and what you see before me, this giant mess of Beyblade stuff, is all the random T5 packages that the Slash 5 has sent me. That including mangas, Beyblades, launchers, and extra stuff. I still have all the packages, I'm pretty sure. So anyways, I've been meaning to do a video for all of these for an extremely long time and I never got to it, mainly because no camera and also it's just been not that easy just getting motivated to make any videos, but but honestly I have, I'm very much in the mood for making a video right now. So I'm going to go over as many of the things as I can in as short amount of time as possible. So let's just get started with right in front of us. So what we have here is, so what the part that Slash gave me here is a Hunter driver from Hasbro. Here on this, on this 3D printed bay he gave me a destroy driver, which was, which is pretty cool. Here is a full bay he gave me, not including this driver. I put this, I put my winning Valkyrie's volcanic driver on this, because my winning Valkyrie is absolute trash now. So he gave me Valkyrie, Sen, Venom, and Vanguard. This is also another GT bay. He gave me this Valkyrie. Um, I don't know the name of this weight. Is it? Uh, I don't know. I don't have time. This is. If you don't know, this is Ace Two and a Hasbro Jaggy. Oh, by the way, the thing I'm recording this also Slash also gave me, which thank you so much. All right. So, in a, another random T5 which actually came in this. This was a specialty pack that he gave me, so if you look in here, I already unboxed all of these. This one, this first one is Samurai Ifritter or Ifrit. Magnum Extend Plus. Magnum, Magnum Extend. He actually did give me an Extend with Extend Plus chip, but um, Extend was broken. But I plan on getting a new extend driver maybe union achilles maybe i'm not sure and this one was buster genius oh yeah that was that crazy modded bay he made with, that included twin nemesis and um, blast genius and this one was z gladiator which is right here his 3D printed bay, Z Gladiator. Unfortunately, there is a slight bit of damage to it from battle. It it did come that way, so it was a little disappointing. The lock is kind of tight. When you try to put in a driver, it gets stuck. So I'm not sure whether to call that a disadvantage as cheating or an advantage for super burst resistance. But yeah. So here are all three of them once again. So one of the characters is actually a Pokemon. By the way, these are all accurate characters to Slash 5's web series. Beyblade Showburst Steel. Guys, be on the lookout for this. I cannot wait for this. Slash has Slash said that he's going to college for animation school for animation studies. I cannot wait for that. I mean, look at this art that he done, that he's made on the packages he's given me. This is just insanely good. This, you can tell he has a unique drawing style, and it's awesome. I really love seeing people's art. So, let's move this out of the way. By the way. When you get a random T5 box, you also get some manga. Yes, I do have the Zelda book slash, but I don't know where it is at the moment. 
All right. Next, we got a few drivers right here. So this is actually one. This is actually a cell slingshot. This is wedge slingshot. I'm and this is power. The in this is a actually a fake power driver because the Phillips screws. So here's a very good thing to know if you're getting fakes. Always look at screws, especially in drivers. The thing about Takara Tomy drivers, like for example this, this trance driver, this actually has a rivet in it. Power right here, it has a Phillips screw. So that's a really good way to know between that. Alright, I need to move along. Man, I am out of breath from talking so fast. Been a while since I've done anything like this. So we got... So here, in my more recent ones, we have Revive and Dead Phoenix, which I am, was really excited to get until until I did find out the locking, the locking part for the gimmick was busted. So when you try to launch it, the armor immediately falls off because it can't lock on properly. I demonstrate, but... Um, See if I can with one hand. Alright, you did hear that, but watch this. That shouldn't come off that easily. Same thing goes for Dead Phoenix, and I really was upset because I wanted to make Perfect Phoenix, which is really a cool layer, which is a really cool layer, but unfortunately it wasn't able to work out. And when, um, here is the newest addition, a legit Chozetsu Achilles. And um, if I were to make uh, separate videos on each of these, if when I made, if I, when I were to make this video, the video would have been titled uh, "The Slash Five Has Redeemed Himself," because if you don't remember, in one of my previous videos, he gave me a Chozy Achilles as a prize bay, but. It was broken. Alright, so let's move on. Oh, by the way, he also give, gave me the long launcher. For, um, shows that to Achilles. I have already attached it to a grip. There's so much stuff he gave me. I, I don't know where to continue. Alright. So, along with the... Along with the... So along with Revive Phoenix, he also gave me this 10 disc, which is what I'm using on my Genocide Jabberwalk right now. Put that back together later. So this bay actually was together. Nope, wrong driver. With the Acel Slingshock, it came with this layer, which didn't make much sense. So sorry if I'm talking a little bit fast, but... I'm trying to get through this as much as possible in 15 minutes, which, of course, YouTube only gives me that long. I swear, YouTube's rules. Here's some really awesome little micro bays. By the way, if you have normal Hasbro launchers, like actual Hasbro launchers, you can actually use the cords in these little ones to, like, to, like supercharge their speed and make them way faster. So, here's the cord normally. And this is a normal Hasbro cord. Here's just some random glive disc or frame. Alright, so in one of the ran one of the random T5s, he actually gave me Buster Excalibur, Archer Hercules, and an Air Knight. But that Air Knight has been completely shattered because of how brittle the plastic got. And it just failed. It, it, it's no longer usable at all. The locking thing that's inside of it, the locking mechanism is snapped out. The entire thing is unable to function at all. But yeah. So another one in more recent ones, he gave me this bearing driver which is really cool. A little bit shaky from usage. You can see like little marks from where it's been used heavily, sort of. 
but yeah, it still works just fine, and I'm using it on Rebel Rinsler. So, guys, make sure you go print down my designs. They really are strong, especially when you print them in full. When you print them fully, yeah, that's a little thing that happened. When you print them fully, when you print print them in full infill, that's what I'm trying to say, and in a really strong plastic material or whatever material you have, I always use carbon fiber because that's why I have available to me. You can actually these these designs really hold up nicely. So far, nothing has had any true major damages. Other than the sword on my Genocide Jabberwock failing, so far all these other ones are fine. I only dropped this one and it snapped off on like a so solid wood. But at any rate, this all, all my designs really work well. So go ahead and print them. Anyways, so just because he actually sent me a DVD full of songs on a soundtrack which is re which actually sounds really nice some of them are really good and some of them eh, they're okay um let's see what else so along with Z gladiator he also gave me this it also came with a zero disc and volcanic dash from hasbro speaking of hasbro he also gave me a fafnir an Anubius and a loop driver he, oh by the way this wall driver he also gave me I don't have Chosey Spriggan I kind of wish I did but I I don't really need him here's a tower slingshot driver and a four disc he most likely yeah this is the four disc he gave me Oh man, I know I'm going all random with this, but I think I pretty much covered everything. If there's anything in here you saw that you want me to look over again. Oh wait, he also just sent recently sent me Pokemon cards. I don't play Pokemon. I don't play with Pokemon cards at all. But I, I'm keeping this. I'm I'm absolutely saving this. I'm, I'm keeping this in a special place. I love the movie a lot. Detective Pikachu. That, that, was, that was really good. I loved it. So there's like a bunch of Pokemon cards in here. Nothing too special except for my Detective Pikachu. <laughs> I love the thing right here. Coffee break. That's awesome. Oh man. Well, anyways, guys, here are all the packages, books, this thing, and all the Beyblade stuff that he gave me, and Pokemon. Um, Slash, if you see anything that's here that I did not include, just tell me in the comments. But, yeah. Oh, by the way, if you want... Oh, by the way, here's proof that I'm using the actual thing. Alright, there you go, Slash. But yeah, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in a flash.